Well, thank you for watching and taking the time out to check out what obviously must be a rather spurious video. It's hardly a video at all. Um, today is the 22nd of April 2019 and I began my hero's journey in the classical sense at 12.45 p.m. It's now uh, 1.33 p.m. as I'm recording this for you now. So I just want to point out that I'm starting my own journey and you probably in the future are curious as to what this journey is all about. Essentially, we need heroes. We need them more than ever and let's see if we can make some. So broadly speaking, I'm setting off on a journey inviting you on a course, on the course, through the course of that journey to become your very own hero. It doesn't matter what gender, orientation or creed you are or how able or not you are. This is a journey where you surpass limitations that are only imposed on you by yourself. But more on that later. So day one of your hero's journey begins with a 20 minute walk or preamble. Doesn't matter how far you get, but document it somehow. Try to see something new or interesting. Move at your own pace and try, if you can, to go somewhere that you wouldn't ordinarily go. You know the whole, uh, I took the road less travelled thing. And before you set off on your journey, I want you to pack what we're going to call an adventure bag. And this bag can be any sort of bag you like, a plastic carrier bag or a handbag or a backpack or a messenger bag or any, any literally any kind of bag. Right now, your adventure bag doesn't need to contain very much at all. So for the sake of clarity, I took a really cheap rucksack with a lot of pockets because in the course of this whole thing, we're going to be adding all sorts of interesting and useful stuff to what we take on our adventures because it's adventures that heroes go on. So this time, just take some water, maybe a mobile phone, your keys, and maybe a camera. If you don't have a mobile phone or a camera, write down in a notebook or any scrap piece of paper what you saw, where you went, the date and time, how long you were walking. So I went out for 20 minutes, and the start of any journey is just breaking that habit of not going outside. Okay, and I was listening just a few weeks ago to a, an ex-Navy SEAL PT instructor by the name of Jocko Willenick. And he's like big on workouts and stuff like that. And he's an ex-Navy SEAL and he's super tough and stuff like that. And we're not. But that's not a problem. Maybe one day you will. Maybe one day you'll feel that you don't need to be tough and dangerous and stuff like that. So essentially, as he says, once you get outside the door, you've won the first battle of the day. So if you're watching this and this inspires you to go outside even just for 20 minutes and have a walk around your local area, just 10 minutes there, 10 minutes back, maybe take a few photographs, maybe make a note of anything that's occurred to you, how you would become a hero, what would make you heroic. You don't even have to write it down. But if you keep a diary, the wonderful thing about keeping a diary and the whole point of it is that you can look back and go, do you know what? Day one, all I did was walk 10 minutes from my house and walk 10 minutes back took me 20 minutes and I broke that habit because I personally I sit around a lot of the time I do things that harm me I've done mean things in my life I don't eat right I smoke I don't get any exercise so today I broke that pattern you know against all odds I went outside just went for a walk in the sunshine that's why I'm starting in April the weather's nice and it doesn't matter if the weather isn't nice you went outside that's the important thing so to clarify things, and there will be other videos, you know, watch this first later on, but this is video one. It's only got a few photographs in it and that's, you know, I needed to create it quickly so that the journey of, of the whole channel will change. This is just a few photographs of me rambling on for five minutes. So later in the series, we'll try and complete the UK Armed Forces Army Fit course, which is designed to take pretty much anyone from a couch potato and turn them into a soldier. We'll also, in addition to that, learn to meditate improve our surroundings, improve our, fan, our financial state, improve our mental health maybe, I know I could use it. I get depressed very easily and that will knock me off my feet for a couple of days. And you'll learn new skills. Whilst what we're going to try and do is just squeeze it down to one hour, day, hour a day to making things generally better and once things are as, you know, as good as we're going to make them or we're on the road to making them better, the world just might have a new army of heroes. Imagine what we could do with one hero. Imagine what we could do with two, or ten, or a thousand, or a million. And then we could, you know, if you live in a democracy, then you could probably make some really good changes in the world. And that's what heroes do. But first, we need to go on our hero's journey. And I hope you'll join me in the second video, which will be tomorrow. 
probably a little bit earlier. Let's see if we can break some habits and become more effective that benefits not only us, but everybody else. Anyway, thank you for watching, and it would be great to know that you've watched this video. If you feel like putting a comment in, comments are open, and there'll be an email address, address down below at the bottom of this video. But thank you again. Thank you so much for watching, and hopefully we can all take a journey together and just build a community of heroes that's inclusive, where everybody can take a little time out and join the ranks of the people that will be in a, in a, in a state where they can start making things better for other people. But we need to start off with ourselves. You need to look after yourself before you can look after other people. Take care.